Hey, hey, Brian Sensei here. In this video, we're going to talk about generative AI and how it's now built into Padlet, which is an amazing app that allows you to share ideas on a digital dashboard. Well, now when you share an idea, you can actually generate images through a feature called I can't draw. Let's check it out. Okay, so first we're going to go ahead and open up our internet browser and we are going to head over to padlet.com. Okay, once you're here, you're going to go ahead and log in. You can log in with Google or Microsoft or Apple accounts or you can go ahead and create a account with any email address by clicking sign up at the top right here. I'm going to go ahead and log in with Microsoft. All right, so the way Padlet works is first you need to create one and share it with your audience who will then access your Padlet and add content to it. So I'm going to go ahead and make a Padlet up here. And you have options here on the types of Padlet walls that you create. You can do a canvas, you can do a timeline, a grid, a stream, a wall, etc. All right, once you make that selection, I'm going to go ahead and choose a wall. Here you have the opportunity to name your Padlet, give it a description, customize the wallpaper, color scheme, etc. And you have some other settings around how your audience can interact with the Padlet, including turning on and off comments, reactions, requiring approval for the posts and other settings. I'm going to go ahead and modify the wallpaper here. And I'm going to save that. And I'll go ahead and close this sidebar. Now I'm ready to share this with my audience. I'll go to the share button here at the top right, and I will copy the link to the clipboard. And now I can share this with my audience. All right, so the way this works is when my audience comes in, they can come in and respond to my prompt by adding their ideas down here, clicking on the plus, when you click on the plus, this provides a variety of different ways for you to share content. You can type in text or you can upload a file, take a photo and post it with your camera. You can provide a hyperlink. You can search for an image and add that to the wall. And here we'll go to the more menu. So here we have a variety of other ways to add content to the wall. Notice this one here called I can't draw. I'm going to click on I can't draw. And here is where I can type in something custom that I would like to have generated by the artificial intelligence. So for example, let's just have some fun and we'll ask for a painting of a giraffe parachuting and we'll hit enter and we'll let it do its trick and generate that image for us. All right, and boom shakalaka, there we have six different options for us to choose from. I kind of like this one here. I'll go ahead and select that one and I'll click on publish. And now my creation is added to the Padlet wall for all to see. All right, and that is how you use generative AI using Padlet. I hope this video was helpful. If there's something specific that you would like to learn about in terms of tech tips, please let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, I'll see you on the next one.